In her recently released postmortem memoir, Lisa Marie Presley discussed her experiences in the Church of Scientology. Riley Keough, Lisa Marie Presley's daughter, is the publisher. Presley did narcotics from the age of 13 to 17 before her mother checked her into a Scientology treatment facility. Presley passed away last year at the age of 54. In her reflections, Presley stated that science actually helped. The church felt radical in an exciting way. It didn't feel like an organized religion, really. The speaker went on. It drew hip, eccentric, creative types. Turned into my group. The singer acknowledges that she broke a few rules when she first checked into the Scientology Celebrity Center as a teenager, even though she still enjoys her time in the religion. She writes, I took down the big mirror from the wall the first morning, called my coke dealer, and invited him and maybe six or seven other people over. We had a four-day bender in that room after that. In 2014, Presley departed from Scientology, and there are rumors that her daughter Riley did as well. Presley experienced many tragedies in his life. After a protracted struggle with addiction, her son Benjamin, then just 27 years old, took his own life in July 2020. In 2008, while recuperating from the birth of her twin girls, Harper Vivian and Finley, she was prescribed a short-term opioid prescription, which led to the breakup of her two-year marriage to Michael Jackson due to his drug misuse. She was misusing cocaine severely by 2013 and had checked herself into treatment at least five times. Although it was thought that she had been clean in the past, her ex-husband Michael Lockwood expressed concern that she would relapse after the passing of her son. At the age of nine, the daughter of Elvis and Priscilla Presley passed away from a heart attack at the age of 42. It is believed that her father's addiction to prescription barbiturates may have contributed to his death. She used drugs as a teenage rebel from the age of 13 to 17, but her mother enrolled her in the castle, a Hollywood Scientology facility, to help her kick the habit. I did everything except use crack, heroin, and mushrooms, she declared. Cocaine, sedatives, marijuana, and alcohol consumption concurrently. I'm not sure how I made it through at point one day. I woke up to find many people on the floor. I exclaimed to myself while I was driving to the Church of Scientology, Someone, help me right now. It helped for a while. Lisa Marie claimed that starting at age 17, she had stopped using drugs. She wed Michael Jackson for the second time at the age of 27, following a six-year marriage to Danny Keough, an actor and the father of Benjamin and Riley, his 35-year-old sister. Her third marriage to Nicolas Cage ended after just three months. Cage, who famously admitted to taking magic mushrooms with his cat, had also struggled with drug addiction during his 20s. She wed guitarist Michael Lockwood in 2006, and after their twin children were born, she started misusing opioids, which led to her own decline into drug addiction. The extent of her issue became evident during her harsh 2016 divorce from Lockwood, which followed 10 years of marriage. In a 2017 deposition that Radar Online was able to access, she acknowledged misusing alcohol, cocaine, opiates, and painkillers. On January 12, 2023, Presley went into cardiac arrest at her Calabasas home. She was only 54 years old when she passed away later that day, and an autopsy determined that her cause of death was a small bowel obstruction after a recent bariatric procedure.